Welcome to this edition of Get to Know Your Wayne State Football Program for the upcoming 2023 campaign. I'm Sports Information Director Jeff Weiss, and joined today by tight ends coach Pat Fogarty. Pat, welcome to Wayne State. Uh, um, give the folks a little bit of background. I understand you played collegiately down in Florida? Yep, I played uh, down at Stetson University, uh, part of a brand new program that started in 2013. Um, after that, moved back down to Savannah for, uh, for about a year. I was there for well, I moved there like 2017, worked a sales job, and then I was coaching high school for about three years, okay. and then I went up to Bowling Green. Sounds great. Um, Wayne, uh, the Wayne State offense for the upcoming years kind of incorporated the fullbacks into the tight end room now, and you've got some guys that have had some collegiate experience. Hopefully that helped you during the spring ball, but you've got Nathaniel Eberly Rodriguez, Tommy Warhardo, Nick Hayward, and John Reba and Kavian Ross that have at least played in college and stuff like that. What can you tell us about that group of guys? Yeah, so I thought they uh, did a great job this spring. You know, I was very impressed with just how hard they worked this spring and, uh, you know, just how they were taking all the coaching. Uh, you know, Rod is a very good player. Um, you know, I'm very excited to coach him. You know, he's a very good blocker and very good route runner. You know, uh, Reba did a really good job this spring. He's a competitor, very, you know, got a great competitive spirit. Uh, really enjoy coaching him, excited to see what he can do this fall. Uh, you know, Tommy did a good job this spring. You know, he's a very strong kid in the weight room, did a good job. And then uh, Kevion Ross, he, uh, I mean, he's a he's a really good athlete. You know, he, uh, he did a lot of special things for us this spring. He's done a great job working really hard, not only in football, but you know, also in the classroom this this year, and then, uh, you know, Nick Hayward did a really good job for us too. Yeah, he was an interesting guy. Yeah, you know, researching him, he played eight man football, which I not really, I don't think I've ever seen a game in person before. So, yeah. I wonder how his adjustment has been to college football. Yeah, he he's done a great. He did a great job this spring. I was very impressed with Nick. You know, he's he's a very good blocker. He can do. You know, he. Uh, He'll do anything you tell him to do. You know, he's he's not afraid to put his head in there and, and work and, and block. So, very impressed by by Nick. And then uh, you know, Osis did another. You know, he did a good job for us too. Uh, you know, he was an uh, offensive lineman before, right? And then moved over to tight end. So he's a very good blocker. You know, big body. And then uh, uh, Gabe Mendoza's done a great job as well. You know, he uh, he's had a great summer. He's been all the workouts. He, he's been you know busting his tail. He's done a really good job for us. Sounds good. So you've got a pretty good room, and you've added one recruit, Joe Ben Scooter. Have you been able to see anything on film on him? Yeah. So I watched Joe. He's a. Uh, I'm excited for for him to come. You know, when he uh, later this summer, he uh, very good athlete. You know, got a great frame. Uh, he, uh, you know, very athletic. He can run. So I'm I'm very excited to work to work with Joe. And talking to Coach Damasi earlier, he had mentioned that, you know, the team that wins the rushing battle, in his mind, wins. And obviously you're talking about all these guys that are good blockers, so right. but also can run some routes and make some plays. So it sounds like you've got a good group of guys to work with this fall. Yeah, absolutely. So obviously, you know, we're, you know we want to be able to run the football, obviously, because that's going to set up the passing game. But, uh, no, they, they, they've done a good job, a great job, I should say, of, uh, you know, coming in and, you know, doing all the individual drills and then applying it to the to the field. Sounds great. Well, thanks again for watching this edition of Get to Know Your Wayne State Football Program.